updated and with it we now have access to a new zenkai unit and a new free-to-play unit but before we get into any of that we actually do have a sponsor for today's video so we're going to check that out first and then we'll get back into the video. Today's video is sponsored by Backbone. The Backbone One is a mobile input controller that allows you to plug in your phone and play your favorite games on the go. Using the Backbone One is really easy. All you have to do is stretch it and put your phone inside. It doesn't get any easier than that. Also, since the new iPhone 15 series of phones now have USB-C, it is now fully compatible with the newest version of the Backbone One. Of course, Android phones work just as well. The Backbone One comes with a QR code for their app, which allows you to access all of your favorite games in one place. PS Remote Play, Xbox Cloud Gaming, Steam Link, and much more. It's all there. One of the best parts of the newest Backbone One is that you can use your phone with the Backbone One without having to take off your phone case. And it's all thanks to the new adapters included in the box. And Kingdom Hearts fans, from what I've been told, it seems that the Backbone One is compatible with Kingdom Hearts Missing Link. So if you want a more traditional experience with that game, then the Backbone 1 is the right choice for you. So if you're interested in the Backbone 1, then make sure to go to playbackbone.com or click my link in the description below as well as in the pinned comment to get yours today. And thank you so much to Backbone for sponsoring this video. All right, so today we're gonna hop into PvP and we're gonna be using Zenkai LF Grade 8 Vegeta. Yes, that was the unit that ended up getting the Zenkai. I, I was wrong about my prediction, but that's totally fine, right? Because at the end of the day, this is a unit that deserves a Zenkai. So I'm still happy that he got it. But this is the team. I'm hoping everything will turn out well. Anyway, let's do it. So his Zenkai boosts red and powerful opponent. So I'm assuming that part two is going to be based off a of powerful opponent, especially because what uh, I think Rose is back as well and Gogeta, who's a uh, god key. So I'm assuming powerful opponent and god key. Ooh. Okay. You, you, and you. Yeah, that's... That's it. Okay. Oh, uh, this is gonna be... Oh, wait. I didn't see him in the back. Crap. Wait. Hold on. Okay. 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 So, we're good. We're good. I was gonna lead off with Janemba, but I was like... I was thinking he was gonna lead off with Gohan, but he did. So, like, I thought he was gonna lead off with future Gohan. That would've been a better choice, but, hey, you know? That's actually a really bad hand. Yeah, that, that's a terrible hand. Okay, so I can shut down a few things with this. Key Blast, you're not going to be doing damage with him. Okay, I know if I cover change, so I don't care. Die. Oh, cool, get paralyzed. Repent for your sins. Die. Cool, and they're activated. Just charged in. Alright, cool. Oh, well, there's that. Bye, future Gohan. If only I had a special skill. Also, this connection is buttery. What the heck, bro? What is going on here? This connection smooth. You have a special move? Okay. Why would I change? Or not change, but why would I vanish? No, like... The moment he popped the special skill, I knew he was going to drop the combo. So I'm like, cool. Drop your combo, then throw it out. So not only do you waste it, but I get to land my ultimate attack. It's a free ult. Rose. You go crazy. We're nullifying your endurance right now. Okay, cool. Trunks is dead. So... Uh, I mean, we saw what Vegito was capable of doing against Element Factor Advantage. He decimated future Gohan. So, now we just have Beast Gohan. This is not going to be funny. What the heck? Oh, whoa, hold on. Whoa. Hold on there. Okay. Uh, one card should be destroyed and one should be sealed. He's still dealing a lot of... Oh. Oh, that's not going to be good. I gotta be very careful. If he throws out special move, Vegeta's dead. Woo! No, you need to get in now. Dead. Dead. As simple as that. Okay. Now that's game. Dang, that's unfortunate, man. Like, because it was that last timer count, bro. Like, that timer count was not going away. 
Um, but I will say that connection was buttery. God dang, like that was the smoothest connection I've experienced in Legends in a very long while. I'm talking about dude was, had to have been in like the same vicinity as me. Like that connection was buttery, holy. But um, again, we did get to see a bit of, of Vegeta in that battle. We did get to have him paired up against future Gohan and he dealt good damage, right? I wanted to get Janemba in as fast as possible the moment I saw Beast Gohan use that special skill because I didn't want his endurance to get nullified, but it was just too late. Okay, next battle. Um, I'm gonna lead off with you, you're going in. And... Oh, dang. Either option is just gonna be dangerous all around. Vegeta, or not Vegeta, Gogeta nullifies endurance with Rising Rush as well, so that's not gonna be fun. Uh, you're gonna die against Gohan, you're just gonna be combo food for him. So... I'll, I'll bring Rosé. I did wanna bring Jiren. Uh, cause he would at least be neutral, but I do want to have something advantageous against Trunks. So that way Vegeta can at least live, but we'll see. Okay. So he didn't lead off with, uh, Gohan with like I would have hoped, but I'm fine with that too, because at the very least he's either advantageous or neutral. So him, he's going to be either neutral or at a disadvantage and he'll be either advantageous, neutral or at a disadvantage. So if there's any unit that's safe. It's him, which also means that no matter what, he cannot die. Like, if anything, if I were to put anybody on the chopping block for the sake of content, it would be Rosé. But we'll see what happens. If he throws in uh, Gogeta and I have Janemba in and then he rushes, then I'll throw in Vegeta because he has Endurance. And uh, Janemba will nullify all of that. So, you know, the Endurance nullification. Okay, let's see. Yes, power. Okay. Decent hand. I'm the one who has to do this. I was like, I know I am sidestepping for my life. Alright, throw this out. Alright, I need Gogeta to come in. Okay, cool. That's the only reason why I didn't throw out Rose, because I wanted to at least deal effective damage. That would have been the perfect opportunity for a special skill. And then it gets drawn after... Okay. Then it gets drawn afterwards. Okay, this connection's not smooth. There's a bit of delay. Alright, there we go. Ha! There we go. Keep that going. Alright, I need this to do damage, because he does deal extra damage against blue units. Like, he deals extra damage against blue units, so if this is strong enough, this should wipe him out and nullify his endurance. Ha! A little bit of something there, a little bit of something there. There goes my special move. Cool. What are you going to do? <laughs> like, the moment I saw that, I'm like, well, luckily I have one blast starts. Thank you for the free ultimate attack. Okay, so now Gogeta's gauge is completely empty. He's probably going to let Gogeta take the hit. Yeah, so we're still cycling, but I will say the special move, or not special move, uh, the ultimate damage against Trunks actually wasn't bad. It really wasn't. You have to pop main to live. Oh, was not expecting that. Okay, I want to get Rosé in. No, this this falls in line with what I wanted. That's fine. Uh, let's see. Yeah, go change all five. That's okay. As long as Gogeta is not the one rushing, then I'm okay. Woo! There's that. You have a special move, backing off. There we go. Oh, can I even take a Gallic Gun? No! No! There we go, I know if I cover change. 
All right, bye, Gogeta. Okay, so there's that. And activate Endurance. There we go. Now you have no defensive measures. I tackle, too. I actually tackled and nothing happened. Okay, Vegeta. Is that all you've got? I saw that sidestep. Come here. Mm! Oh, that's right. Gohan blocks it. Gohan blocks it. That's right. Like, he's able to block AoEs once, but... No, oh, that's fine. Uh, like I said, if there was a unit that I would sacrifice, it, it would be him. So, that's fine. Okay, and I believe Gohan did use his main. So, all I need to do really is just tackle. And we're okay. Or at least I hope so. Oh, yeah, that's that's it. That's absolutely game. There's no way around it. Um, Yeah, I forgot that this Gohan nullifies AoEs once um, after he transforms. So, there's that. It's, it's only because I've seen it a handful of times, right? Actually, I think that's probably like the third time that I've seen that. So, yeah. But um, Vegeta, he held his own for sure. And not only that, the ult damage was actually pretty good. Um, especially like it being against a unit that he's disadvantageous against. So, I'm, I'm honestly impressed so far. But the main thing that I really want to do is to be able to actually just fight the other units, right? Like, I can't really get him in because every time Vegeta's in, the opponent is able to throw in the blue unit. So, hopefully in this, like, final battle, we'll be able to do so. Nope, that's not happening. Okay. I'm going to lead off with him. Uh, you're definitely going in. Actually, and that's a coverage I need anyway against Gotenks because he has endurance. Uh, you cover him, so yeah, bring in Rosé. That's it. So, the only unit I have to look out for is him. He's the only one that has an advantage against any of my units. So, if he goes, then hopefully it'll be game. He led off with him. Okay, so... If I have a special skill, I will keep Vegeta in. If not, then I'm going to sidestep because he's probably just going to attack. And then I'll try to get Rosé in there. But, um... I cannot rush. Actually, I don't think I even have the room to rush. Like, I have to get rid of the red Gohan as fast as I can. Because Gotenks is not going to deal damage. The worst possible hand. That paid off at the in the end. Get him out. Oh, please. Well, actually, not really. I mean, I want Vegeta to be able to fight. It's just the blue unit, bro. That's all it is. That actually helped me, too, because having all strike is not good. It's fine. Another special skill. I'm immune to that. Fine, then I'll charge it and hope for the best. All right, let's get it going. He really cover changed afterwards. Please don't have a special move. Will I get a special skill? No. Okay, sure you can. That hurt a lot. Oh, wait, did I not select Janemba? Can I swap, please? I was like, I know I selected Janemba. The fact that it didn't even execute's crazy. Okay, then, guess it's my turn. No. Okay, so that is. Well, let's see. This should not be hitting that hard. Perfect vanish. Oh, here goes Gotenks. Alright, I'm AoEing this. Ah, there we go. All the damage. Alright, I knew I was going to take that card. Whatever. I expect the beast to come in. Uh, Again, this will let us know if it's if it really does decent damage or not. Let's see. And... Die! That is good damage for disadvantageous, like, damage. I definitely press strike. Well, at least I had a special move. Follow up. Hmm. Yes. Die. 
taking full advantage. Let go tanks die. Just don't, please. Thank you. <laughs> there we go. Next up, let Beast Gohan die. Don't, don't do this. Well, you know. Okay, as long as this deals effective damage against Gohan, preferably if it wipes him out. I mean, yeah, Gohan knocks down sub counts by four when, like, these type of moves are used, but I guess. I'll take it. He ate that hit. I was swiping for my life. He's, he's gonna launch that thing. No! What? Bro, no! Vegeta has endurance! He really had all blast. Well, okay, now I understand why you did it, but... No, Vegeta has endurance. Yeah, you don't nullify that, so... You can back off if you want, that's fine. Yeah, you're not gonna cover chain, so just let him take the hit. Oh, perfect! Even better! And plus, a lot of time accounts has passed, so Vegeta's supercharged. Hmm! And die! One Gohan down! No. Okay, it's a good thing that he tackled, because I literally had both strike and blast cover in the end. That is okay with me. All the damage, all of it. Yeah. And there we go. And there's that. So, yeah. Um, I, I will say that Vegeta was able to hold his own very, very well. I think what I'm more so impressed with is the fact that his ultimate attack, especially, like, the longer the battle goes on, right? Because the longer the battle goes on, the stronger he gets. And um, I will say, though, that not only is he, like, a good defensive option because of his endurance, but... He's like that that sleeper offensive option as well, where you can have him up against a blue unit. Obviously, if he takes damage from blue units, he's, he's going to feel pain, right? He's a red unit. But they're not going to be expecting his ultimate attack to hit that hard against a blue unit. Because more often than not, when you're at a disadvantage and you use a special move or you use an ultimate attack, it's usually not going to hit hard at all. Un unless there's like varying circumstances that like boost its power. But with Vegeta... Again, he has one of those circumstances. He deals extra damage against blue units, and it showed with that ultimate attack. So, honestly speaking, I think that this is a really good Zenkai, but apart from just that, it also makes me wonder what we're going to be getting for part two of the Legends Festival, just because he's a powerful opponent unit, and I know Rosé is back as well, and then we also got a free-to-play Frieza? So it's leading me to believe that part two might be something based on a powerful opponent unit, from whatever saga, I don't know, but that's besides the point. Either way, though, I do want to know in the comment section below if you guys do have LF Grade 8 Vegeta Zenkai LF Grade 8 uh, Vegeta to at least uh, Zenkai 3. What teams did you put him on, and how did he work out for you? Again, let me know in the comment section below. But with that being said, I'm Nakuba. Like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.